Hey, what's up? I'm having to mess around with the VMS2 and Virtual DJ Pro today. Now, the first night I did the video club, I ran into a problem. The second night, I didn't have that problem because I came up with a solution. Let me show you what I'm talking about. All right, so we're rocking music video. All is well. We're at a video club. We get a request for a song, or we just feel like playing a song we don't necessarily have a video for. We put it in deck B, we press play, we move our crossfader over, and we don't have any video. Well, what do you do? Let me show you something. We're gonna need some kind of video to add into Virtual DJ when we're playing MP3 files. It's real easy to do. The first thing you need are files. Now, what I suggest is get some ambient stuff. I've got some cool stuff I got from MixMash. Here are a couple of them right here. Scrub, I got a big stack of them. This one's called Street Level. This is like hip hop stuff, turntables, dubs spinning on cars. Kind of a cool visualization on that one. This one is interesting. This one is VizHop. This little mouse looks like a dead mouse with vampire teeth. This is a cool one. I play this one a lot. There's a whole stack of them. Now what I did with these is I ripped them into my computer with the program Handbrake. Now I did a Handbrake tutorial over a year ago. And if you don't know what it is or how to do it, I'm going to put a link to my Handbrake tutorial right down here in the description of this video. This is a free, totally free program that you can download and rip in virtually anything you want. Now you can also alternately make your own visualizations out of old black and white cartoons or video clips you take yourself. You can get as creative as you want with this. But these are cool. People like them. I like them. They look great. Check them out. Here's what we do after we rip them in with Handbrake. So in Virtual DJ, click on the Config tab go to the video tab and way down here it says use plugin for audio only files I click on that in the drop down menu here I select clip bank highlight it and click OK then I go down here to effects now these are your clip bank effects you can put into virtual DJ you can add anything you want so I'm gonna add one to this first clip bank. This is all the stuff that I've ripped in from MixMash. I'm going to choose this one, MixMash VizHop Mouse, I called it. Double click on it, and bam, there it is. It's added to the clip bank. Now I can add more if I want to. Click on this one, I'll add Street Level. Click on this one, let's see, this one's MixMash Night Lights. I'll click on that one. We'll do one more. We'll do MixMash When Worlds Collide. It's like a bunch of collages. We'll click on that one and now we've got four different visualizations to choose from in our clip bank. Now all you have to do is go back to browser and start DJing and you're gonna have video when you crossfade over into a regular old MP3. Alright here we are we're VJing. We're gonna play an MP3 file. We simply press play move our crossfader over and we have a visualization. Now maybe you don't want that one. Maybe you want one of the other ones that you've added to the clip bank. You can actually change that on the fly. You simply go to effects and click on the effect you want. Any effect at all. You can change them up however you'd like. Simply by clicking on it with your mouse. Now you can also go into those clip banks that I showed you. You can right click and you can loop the clip. So if your clip's not real long, it'll just loop as long as you're playing it. So that was my solution. There's a little tutorial for you today on Virtual DJ Pro when you're doing music video. Little tip for you. Check out MixMash. I'll put the link right down here in the description. Practice and enjoy.